Yo guys, so today now we are here back at Gardens by the Bay East. We're gonna be doing a little bit of sound test. Uh, we got the Aileron V1, Aileron V2. We got loads of gear on me. I don't think you can see that, but we're gonna be setting it up and we'll try a slightly more scientific test. Not not terribly so, but just slightly, all right? Okay, let's get on with it, all right? Come, let's go. kind of set up the equipment uh, left one little thing what we're gonna try to do now is that we're gonna be skating past like this setup so this is the H1N uh, zoom mic which will be right beside this uh, sound meter which is uh, something I borrowed it is from I don't know which brand but it's a SL4033 SD and filming that will be my GoPro Hero 4 and I will be operating my old Canon 60D and Hongi will be operating this camera right now which is uh, the Canon M6 we will be testing the Aileron V1 and the Aileron V2 so we'll be going by we'll try to follow this line and all the audio that you're gonna be hearing next uh, when we start the test will all be from this H1N so I'm trying to replicate what this thing will be hearing okay so all we have to do now is to kind of manually set uh, the volume levels of this one I'm gonna get Hongi to like lean on the ground as close as possible there and start talking so that we can then adjust uh, this uh, uh, audio to be set at a, a manual uh, level rather than auto and then it keeps, keeps adjusting so I know this is not amazingly scientific um, but We'll see what happens, alright? So, let's get the audio set. Test, one, two, three, test. Okay. Good. Test, one, two, three. Alright, let's start recording on this. Bye. GoPro, can you turn off? Oh, yes. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna try um, standing start first, and okay. then after that, we're gonna go uh, move off. So, Hongyi will be holding this camera. I'll be trying to shoot the B roll camera so that we we'll see how the edit goes later, okay? So, I'm gonna pass the camera to Hongyi right now, okay? Say All right. Hi. So, <laughs> All right, so uh, we're just gonna do a aileron V1 test. From stand still. That's right, Yongsheng, ready? Ready. All right, just gonna do one more test. One, two, three, go. the sound when you start off from the aileron V1 we're just gonna hit back for a bit all right so, uh, let's swap over to uh, the V2 okay yeah so we're swapping over to the V2 now, now. Um, see how it goes yep V1 swap and V2 right so Just gonna make sure it's in the correct, as close yeah, to the mic as possible. All right. So this is how is we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna run the V2 aileron aileron V2 test from standstill. <coughs> All right. All good. All good. Right. One, two, three. We're gonna run the V2 aileron, aileron V2 test 
Bob, stand still. All right. All good. All good. All right, one, two, three. Of course, everybody needs to know um, the V1 is actually running on a BLDC mode and the V2 is running on FOC. So uh, obviously startups, uh, there will be some uh, reduction in noise with the V2. Uh, but I think it's also important to take note of the sound that's coming out from the gears. Yeah. I think that, that's a good take. Yeah. Um, let's try like a full throttle. Yeah, okay. So uh, V1 again? Yeah. Okay. <coughs> so let me do the camera. Okay. Right. That was a good take for yep. um, static start. So we're yep. gonna try to go a little bit faster, going through about the same distance, and we'll compare the difference. All right. So yep. Hongi, your turn to try. All right. So we're just gonna do a full throttle, uh, kind of a test. V1 versus V2. Not sure how fast I can pick up, but we'll just give that a try. Camera is very heavy. Why not just use an iPhone, my goodness. Right, so, um, coming up to Yongsheng. Just gonna come around. Just on the... That's about almost full throttle. Just gonna hit back in. All right. Let's try V2. Let's try the V2 now. V2, V2, let's go. So Boom. Let's... Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. Me again? Yep. Okay. Alright, so just gonna same do the same test, full throttle on the V2 to see how it sounds at speed. So I mean say again, like it's BLDC versus FOC. Uh, also the belt versus gear drive uh, sound difference. Coming up to the same start again. Yongcheng is coming up. Alright, so just gonna... One more time. Should feel about the same speed. Didn't dare to push it a little bit anymore. Uh, maybe we should be getting the same kind of speeds against the V1. So I just go and catch up with Yongsheng and see what he says. Okay, so uh, let's change this direction. So. Um, we're gonna check the footage. Hopefully, it shows like uh, what we want to show. Um, I'm not sure, you know, if the GoPro is gonna be able to capture that. But we'll check out the footage later. I uh, hope you enjoy this. It's not like the most scientific. scientific. I understand, but um, it's the best we can do right now. So <laughs> until we think of something better. All right. Okay. Thank you very much for watching. Leave your uh, comments. Remember to give us a like, a subscribe. subscribe, you know, pre-orders are still going on right now. Once again, thank you so much for your response. We love it. Um, yeah, we'll get those bots out to you soon, all right? Out. Hey guys, so we are back in our um, office. Uh, we looked at the video, we saw the data. I guess you guys have seen it now as well. So it's pretty much expected, isn't it? Yep. So at low speeds, 
it's a lot more quieter the V2 compared to the V1. Mm. Uh, what this means is it translates into a much better riding experience in, like, say, the urban commute where you're starting or stopping. There's people around, so that that to us at least when we've been riding the V2 around much much better yeah. uh, and at higher speeds um, it's pretty much similar volume wise it's about the same tonality um, it's a little bit different sound profile right yeah and uh, uh, I think that's also because um, like we've mentioned in the video uh, the V1 has been running in BLTC mode uh, using the VESC and the V2 we've, we've actually swapped back to the FOC mode uh, with a sensor motor so it it's pretty much expected that the startup sounds will be a lot quieter with the V2 compared to the V1. Yeah, yeah. and uh, the thing about our Fusion Drive, as you guys have known, is a gear drive system. Mm -hmm. So uh, we just want to highlight that because it's a gear drive, it doesn't mean that the sound profile or the, the harshness of the sound is terrible. Uh, we've put in a lot of work. The way we've been able to solve that is because we've been using some... Hey. Uh, yeah. no, oh, no, we no. can't say that yet. Yeah, yeah, there's some, still some, some details that we're oh. not able to review oh. at this point. Okay, yeah. so, uh, yeah. yeah, so moving <laughs> on, right? Okay, so, so there's a sound test. I know it's not purely scientific, yeah, but, yeah. you know, we'll, we'll try to think of some other way. I'm not yeah. sure, but, you know, we'll, we'll be doing more videos. Um, mm. Range test is coming up next, yep. I believe. Mm. Uh, and as, 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 as soon as we can review more about the Fusion Drive, we will. We will. Okay, yeah. we will. And uh, looking forward to ship out the bots very, very soon. All right. That's us, right. on the Outbox HQ, out. out.